In a letter that you wrote to us about why you're marrying Sarita, you captured the import of this. You said, she has accepted Sam and Lillian as though they are her own children and treats them with the love, the care, and the compassion of God. She teaches them boundaries, limits, independence, resilience, respect, and responsibility. This union is also about celebrating the family that you all are, and it is important to you both that this was part of the ceremony. Sarita are now husband and wife. A couple days ago, Sarita was showing something on her phone to my wife Yana and I. And we saw she had 174 unread text messages. And we, we were like, how is that possible? Who does that? She said, oh, those are just from Greg. And so we realized that that is the secret to this relationship. You just gotta ignore Greg's text messages. So I wanna raise a glass, mazel tov to Sarita and Greg. Greg, on behalf of everybody else here, out of love, we're all gonna ignore your text messages from now on, so. They're both smart and compassionate, looking out for others, and as it turns out, Greg is just like our mother. <laughs> so now please raise a glass to toast and bless. We hope each day brings as much, much joy as the frequency of Greg's text. We wish you a long marriage of love, health, and sexiness, a life filled with laughter, family, and happiness. And as our father would say, it couldn't hurt to be prosperous. Mazel tov, Greg and Serena. Mazel tov.